We've received a coded message from your Vardwar friend, Commander Eldex. It seems he's finally ready to help us. He wants to meet, and has asked for you by name. He said he wouldn't deal with anyone else. I'm still skeptical, however. This wouldn't be the first time the Vardwar have tried to set a trap for us. So be careful. I've spoken to Admiral Tuvok, and he suggested that Seven of Nine could join you as a technical expert. I see no reason why she shouldn't, and if things go wrong, it will be good to have an ally you can trust. Eldex sent us coordinates for location in the Molinia system. It's not Vardwa space, but there is a Herogen relay in the area. Watch out for unwanted guests. Indeed. And we'll... And we get... This is not... This is not one of the... This one... This mission is relatively easy. Not easy, relatively tricky, but... We get Tetrion weapons, Mark 13s. Not the... Not the best. I mean, that... They're, they're decent, they modded, but they're not the best uh, weapons you can pick up. Hello, would you have time to look into something for me? Yes, we do. So, right, let's add, add, add to the Molina system. We we invited Vodge and the commander. Out, out Oh, next to ship. Okay, open the channel to both ships. Greetings. Admiral Tuvok has requested I assist you for the duration of this mission. Admiral Tuvok understands this may upset Eldex, so I shall be the only one who aids you. Voyager will maintain its distance. I am ready for transport. Understood. Transporting you now. Let's go over the point of this operation. Gaul has called all available supremacy leaders to Cartella. I do not know how many of my people are infected with those creatures we saw there, but I'm sure there is more than one. We need to expose them for the abominations they are. And that's why, that's why we are here at Herodon Communications Ray. You want to use it to, to broadcast the proof to the rest of Vardwa. The Supremacy is keeping a tight control on all subspace transmissions. We'll need control of the array to broadcast what we find on Cartella to not only my people, but the entire quadrant. To control the array, we need to control one of the Herogen ships. Make sure to leave the one I have marked reasonably intact. Leave one intact, understood. And there goes the USS Vajra. So, we have the Vajra assault vessel over here and Commander Eldritch, which looks like a Vajra juggernaut to me. Oh. That's a, a Erosion Communication Display uh, ship uh, station, I mean. And here we go. Let's get awesome. Oh. Intruding Vardwar ships! You have trespassed in Erosion space! We need to use the communications ray. We do, do, don't want any trouble. This is our space, and this is our array. No trades, no compromises, no mercy. Should I shields up? I have a few seconds. We got ourselves stuck in a. That's it down. We need to board the Herogen ship and take the communications console on the bridge. I can use that to take control of the array. Instead, Bob. Well, the Herogen ship and get communication console. 
I have extensive experience with these systems. I will beam down to aid in the operation of the Herogen ship. Are you ready to proceed? Beam to the Herogen ship. We'll get bringing in with us. We need the communications console intact. Whatever else happens is of no concern to me. Understood. We must first disconnect the console from the ship's data network. Okay. First we need to get in here. Open the door. Oh dear. Okay. Oh dear. I have a mission here. Oh, seven? Okay, how about... And that's the console, so disconnect the data subnet... Uh, the data network hub. We also need the isolinear storage assembly. It will be behind a locked door on the bridge. And it's the only door that's locked. Not locked anymore. And she pumps the urgent. Yes, that's just a kit. We just need to find the EPS conduit, so let's check there to that looks like the engineering console. And this looks like the this console is just disconnecting. And beam it to the transporter standing by. Transport complete. Yeah, okay. We have the console. There is no way the Vaudoir will allow a Starfleet vessel into our space, and Cartella defenses have been upgraded since your last trick with the hollow projector. Take one of the ships in my fleet and send yours away. You can contact it once we've completed our mission. I will beam over some of your crew to assist you when we get to our destination. Uh. Let's beam to the, the Vadwell ship. We'll scuttle the Herogen ship so they won't know the console is missing. Then we can continue on to Cartella for the meeting. I have loaned some officers to attend to the duty stations on the frigate you now command. Understood. I'll deal with the ship. This is a... I don't know what this ship is, it's a, it's a Menasha Salta Scott. I'm picking up an incoming Benthan vessel on long range sensors. Our ships are out of range and we are in a Vaudoir vessel. It is unlikely the Benthans will give us a chance to explain the situation. Perhaps we can warn them away from the area. They are not altering course. Disabling their vessel may be the only option. Try to tell them, audio only. Attention, Vaudoir vessels. You are in violation of several codes of conduct in this area of space, and your ships have been identified as perpetrators of crimes against the Benthan Guard and its protectorates. Stand down and prepare to be boarded. Shows up. Yeah, they, they. they cannot escape this system. There is no need to destroy that. Uh. Yeah. 
Give me that gap man a gonna You may have a quarrel with the Benthans, Eldix. We do not. I've jammed the Benthans ship's communications, but I can't signal ruined. for help. You know what needs to be done. No one can know what happened here. You can be suggesting what I think you're suggesting. Unacceptable. The Benthans are performing their assigned duties and have no way of knowing who or what we are. Sensors are detecting damage to the ship's long-range communications array. It will be days before they can restore warp power or send out a signal. We can leave now, complete our mission, and then return later to assist the Benthans. There's we don't war with the Benthans, God. That's not a risk I'm willing to take. They're in range of the Herogen array. They could tap it to send out a call for help, or disable our modifications. The Herogen could return and discover what happened. And if another Vaudwar fleet finds them, there will be questions none of us want to answer. The Benthans must be silenced. I agree with Seven. There's no need to it. No reason, reason to escalate this. We can put him in our brig or tow his ship away to buy ourselves more time. There is no need for more bloodshed. We could take him with us, explain the situation, guarantee his crew safety. We did not need to die. I trust you won't be so squeamish in the future. There is more riding on this plan than the lives of a handful of so called peacekeepers. We'll see. The Borg place very little value on the life of one individual. Captain Janeway and the crew of Voyager showed me that that belief was incorrect. Given all they have been through, I had hoped Commander Eldex would place more value on the lives of others. It appears that his concern only extends to other Vodwar. Watch him carefully. Eldex cannot be trusted. Yes. Well, we've received quotes from Eldex and we, we can leave as soon as we we're ready, yes. Yeah, let's let's go. Gaul has increased security since your last visit. Let me do the talking. Understood. Yeah, it's easy, it's a bottom of my nice escort. Put security code in verification now, okay. Verification code 109947. How that works? Verification accepted. Due to heightened security, all ships are required to reduce speed below full impulse for security scans. Understood. One hurdle cleared. Continue to the manned security checkpoint. I think cost now. Disengage your engines and provide the proper security codes. I've been in many times. I've never needed to read my codes. My predecessor was more lax in her handling of security measures. She has paid the price for her errors in judgment. What uh, is your security code? Um. Verification code Alpha 4742. Commander Eldex and Squadron reporting. Do not make me late for the meeting. Oh, wait, Commander. Code accepted, Commander Eldex. Take your squadron to the marked position on the outer orbit ring. Good day. Yeah, that, that took a little while. Ignore the scans. Fly like you belong here. And this is not actually a bad one. Good thing you didn't try to use a hologram again, isn't it? Yeah, they're just getting like crazy. They're 
and for them be too human. There are 67 ships in this system. That is more than expected. That wouldn't be good if we were found out. Gaul's planning something big. This must be the start. And these and some of these ships are particularly powerful. More ships are just more reasons not to get caught. Indeed. They're putting a great deal of trust in you, Commander. I am after one goal. The liberation of my people from these monsters. I will do anything to achieve that, including betraying Gaul to save us all. More ships and system than I had anticipated. But we can't stop now. Leaving would it only make us It is time for someone suspicious. with a stronger resolve to take up the cause that Gaul has abandoned. Let's go. I'm transmitting coordinates for a secure room near the meeting site. Beam down there. I will have a holographic disguise ready for you. Security is scanning for such tricks on ships, but I'm not sure they realize how many uses there are for hollow emitters. Right, let's beam down. Now we're bringing Ian, Carolyn, and Tamaz. Here, use these hollow projectors. Security is so focused on keeping intruders out of our space that they won't be looking for trouble on the ground. But try not to act suspicious. Our soldiers aren't as dumb as you seem to think they are. You'll need to place these emitters around the leaders, which, when activated, will emit a low-level delta radiation pulse that should disrupt their isoboramine neurotransmitters, forcing their parasites out for a short period. Should work, but it shouldn't won't give us much time. You'll also need to place recording devices, so everything that happens is transmitted to the quadrant. I'll stay here with the transmitter and monitor your progress. This is more than a simple briefing. Gaul might even be here in person. So don't get caught. We're all dead if you do. We're by yourself, Alex. We won't get caught. Alright. So let's go. And we've got seven with us. And we've all got uh, outfits and you. Now I can't remember where. We can get these, these outfits, but you can obtain these outfits. Here we go. Welcome to Catella Ground. Oh. And we were out, I think we were around here last time. I'm maybe not around here, but. This area looks like a very good place for our speech. No. Oh. Console looks like a nice place to drop, drop something. And this console as well. Recording device and no one here. No in here. And go around the side. And we put uh, it here. You'll need to set up a signal booster so we can transmit our signal through the base's electronic security. There's a power console near to where the leadership is addressing the troops. Tie the repeater into the conduits there. Find the 
Find the console and install the signal boost. I can do that. Looks right behind us. Oh, neat. Uh -huh. Over here. Nice. And we just need to have the system to work as repeater. Hey! What are you doing? No one is allowed back here. If we are finished here, I suggest we return to the crowd. Yes, um. Nicely. Oh. We've got a cover button to spot to you need a bag. And spot to see. We're in position. Now hear the yeah. words of our great leader. Go! Sir! What do you want? Someone found the guard. Quick, activate the device. <gasps> what? <coughs> What's happening? <gasps> the monsters! Go, no, you did this! Raider! Fire! What are you? Enough! Why are you letting your eyes deceive you? This is a plot by our enemies. They're trying to divide us. I say no. We will stand strong, united. We are Vodwa, and we will conquer our enemies. That's right. This is insane. I'll stand with you. No, don't betray you. I see some of you are still loyal to our cause. The rest, you are cowards and traitors unworthy to be called Vodwa. Kill them. I think... I think our time here is done. We should make our way to the extraction point. Indeed. I hope you don't. I think there's a faulty light panel up there. Right, that's because the guys in front of the our exit. Get out! Get out now! Right, we're just out of transport to a ship. I need to rally my people, the ones who aren't infected and who are willing to fight. The parasites will crush them if someone doesn't act. My allies are holding one of the space docks in the outer perimeter. Help me get there. I'll start coordinating the fight from there, and you'll be able to return to your ship. Well, we'll get you to the space dock. Um. Too much of the fighting. Yeah. 
We need to confirm the transmission made it to the array. Incoming hostiles, handle this! Very nice. The transmission signal is strong, and it's reaching the Herogen communications array. Now all Vaudois will know about the corruption among us. You should go. I need to prepare my people for the fight ahead. Good luck. And we just need to get the six system, and see, we're going to have to go through the. That. That cruiser first. And I am in contact with Voyager, and it is waiting with your vessel outside this system. We need to depart immediately. Indeed, let's leave. That was an interesting broadcast. Half the quadrants talking about it, and the rest are trying to find a way to claim responsibility for it. It would have been better had you exposed Gaul as well, and taken down the Vardwar leadership in one act. But we'll take what we can get. The Vardwar are in chaos, and if they're fighting one another, they're not fighting us. That will give us some room to maneuver. Indeed, this makes us a lot better. It a lot better. And um, for the for the for the for the, for the weapon, weapon weapons, there is not much between it and more. But matter with what you what ship you're flying now this particular ship is a it's a cruiser and I'm not really using touch one anyway I'll just be picking there yet yeah. anyway there's not much difference in it right. our ship we actually flew was the Vadra Menasha Assault Escort this is believing not available for for just under seven seven hundred million EC. I've got to basically make my own make it a lot better a lot more money. This ship's not particularly common, not particularly well brilliantly as people who were looking for it for it goes, but you can pick it up and it is available within many of the lock boxes in the in one of the lock boxes choices. Sadly I don't have a lock box on me. Right, that's not a lot box, but we in the Infinity T6 pack if you so wish. However, the other Vodwa ship, the 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 Vodwa Juggernaut, starts at 1,000 million and is very, very, very powerful. Um, and it's, see, it's double the price of the other ship. This is considered very top end. Considered very top end as the ships go. And it's more of a newer ship than the rest. And that, with that, we'll be doing another series of patrols. And we'll double up. Doing two a week for, the, for those two weeks, <laughs> for the rest of the weeks. But this may be my show writer. See you next time.